What's up everybody and welcome back to another Fallout 4 settlement video. Before I jump into this one I just want to say a quick happy Memorial Day and definitely give a special thanks to all the servicemen and women out there. You know, appreciate everything you do for this country. Alright, so getting started, what I wanted to do in this video was just take a look at the new structural component that we have in the Fallout 4 DLC, which was barns. Just going to give you a quick heads up. I'm doing this in my sanctuary settlement, and that's where all of my companions are located, so they never shut up while I'm trying to do this. This is about my fourth time. I'm just going to have to try to talk over them, so bear with me. If it's tough to hear, sorry about that, but, you know, you just can't get them to be quiet. Alright, so what I've built is a massive three-story barn here. Turned it into a marketplace for a uh, sanctuary. So we'll head, on si head inside and take a look at what we've got. Only thing better than getting pissed is picking a fight. All right, right. Kate. So first store over here on the right, we've got the general trader housed by the vault tech rep. You know, just got a couple of pieces of scavenged equipment from the <sighs> from hurts. the wasteland, hurts. and hurts. anything that you could possibly need to get some materials. Moving on, we got Anne Hargraves over here uh, tending to the clothing store. So she's got some women's apparel, the dresses, got some suits, hats, so sunglasses, to? and a uh, couple of bandanas over there as well. Next up, got the armor for sale. Over here we got some super mutant armor, got a couple of arm and leg armor, chest armor, definitely got some uh, Brotherhood of Steel helmet for the power armor, and that's about it. Last up, down here on the first floor, you've got the uh, weapons depot. So you got some guns over here on the uh, shelf, some of the high powered guns such as the Fat Man assault rifle, and a missile launcher on this shelf over here. You got that flamethrower in the background, and then you just got some ammo on the on the shelves right here. Now, before we head upstairs, around this corner, just got a little bathroom, something you know, little privacy. Got the door on it, nothing special, just somewhere for the uh, settlers to go. All right, second floor is a little bit of a lounge restaurant area. Got a nice table here, a couple more tables in the background, and then a bar area. So here we've got this guy tending bar. Got Kate standing in the middle of the bar enjoying a nice cup of noodles or so something it looks like. Next? And then in the background we've got some alcohol, Nuka Cola. Got that beautiful looking food paste on those that that pink food paste on those trays. And then just a couple of signs showing what we've got for sale here. All right, last up, we're going to head up to the third level. And this is the sleeping area for some of the merchants working here. So, just got a couple of beds, some storage, and some dressers. And then you got a little desk area if anybody wants to relax, just take a load off. Alright, so that kind of just showcases what I built. And I just wanted to go through this barn building just because the barns give you a whole lot of new, unique opportunities as far as creating buildings. Um, What's different about them is you really can get away from the boxy looking buildings that the steel, wood, and concrete buildings give you. So there's lots of different roofs, all different yeah. types of types and yeah, sizes of wall panels, and it just gives you so many more unique options as far as creating custom buildings. So that's going to do it for this video. Sorry for all the uh, commentating over what I was commentating, you know, all the stupid settlers wouldn't shut up. but. Hey, gotta, gotta work with what you're given. So, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're interested in seeing more Fallout 4 videos um, and definitely more settlement videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.